Okay, so now we're gonna go to object mode. Now object mode you can get to from the drop down menu here, or you can toggle it through this mode switcher. Okay, now in object mode, it's very basic here. We have the child mode, child option here where I label as local, the move, and you have yeah, all your 3D axis, X, Y, Z, and also these diagonal axis is here. And if you click on the center, you can, it's a Una access where you can move it depending on where the camera is at. And if you go to rotate, you can rotate and all three axes. And scale, scale you can also have control over each axis. And Z. And if you select the center, it's a unit scale. And if you we have a mirror there where I will go over in another video and objects this is where you can add extra objects yes i can add a, a cylinder a square and in this mode we have this is i should go over this gizmo this, this gizmo can be found in other modes and it's a is similar to the unit scale, but it also has this um, unit scale and the unit axis where you can move it depending on the camera. Even if it's being blocked by an object, you can still grab it because you have to double tap to select an object, and you can also use the clone in object mode there's actually two clone buttons you got this one here or you can use the, this one in this corner and there's also another access to add in objects so add edit and there you go and scale it if you want now to attach objects you can use the hierarchy where you can hit attach and select what you want and then click attach and that will allow you to move them together or you can use this box select will allow you to select multiple objects all right so you select you select them and you can move them together or you can combine them so if you select them like this way as you can see in the hierarchy, they're all selected. And if you hit attach, attach, and they're all one group. So if you select one, they'll move. It, it doesn't matter which one you select, it will always move as a group. Now, if you need to move one, the other or move one of them in a different location, you have to select local. And then you can move the ones that's selected. But Let's fix that there. Let's use this one here. And then you can move it 
the way you want. There we go. And now it's back to moving as a group when you do that. Now to detach, I guess you, you got all these groups together. So now I'm going to select what we want to detach and hit detach. And now, now it moves on its own. If you select the others, they'll move. And if I want to detach this one, touch now it's on its own and if I select that it's moving on as a group and now if you want to just focus on the only one of the objects you can hide the others there's a little hide icon down here so when you press that it hides everything that's not selected so if I double tap the spear here and press hide, everything is hidden. All right. And now if you want to focus on that, there's the locate icon. So you can press locate and it'll just zoom into that object. And when you rotate, everything is, is centered around that. And if I double click the cylinder, hit locate, it will make that the center and then everything would focus on what you selected. And I can hide everything else again and unhide. And now if I want to delete, I could delete, delete. And when you delete a group, it deletes if you delete one item from a group without that selected, it'll delete everything. Let me undo that. So if I just want to delete one object, I hit that and delete. And if I want to just delete that, delete. And select delete there. Delete. Delete. I think. All right, so I'll go over these other features in another video, but this is it for the basic part of object mode.